Good morning, FossTube. This is my second attempt at a video to show you my sunroom. So we're in the front room and we're looking at the sliding glass doors. And. Oh, Allie's head. Hi, Allie. Hi. Yes, good morning. Husband's slippers. And there's my Sa Sago palm. The doors to our uh, sunroom that go outside, and you'll see the gas grill there on the left. And of course, there's small window panes, and I have some sun catchers. Um, and you'll see the bird bath in the center. And that's the lilac bush right outside. That red um, pot are my um, is my uh, ivy. I have four, three different kinds of uh, varieties of ivy out there in that pot. And that's a, a dress form that I bought for five dollars at the floral shop at our local grocery store. Um, pink splash on the pedestal and a miniature rose bush on the floor. This is swinging around. You can see the plants outside. And that's my, my table with my bamboo and my swing with the cute, oh, there's a Noah, um, cute pillows. They're pears, pear print, my mom gave me on our swing. Remnants of Mother's Day. We've got some sun catchers uh, up there on the roof. And my sign that says, love this moment. Another sun catcher. And there's the doors that go into the house. And, oh, this is the chimney. And I'd like to put like a wreath on the chimney. And this is my shelving unit. It's got some herbs in it and some little uh, bird figurines. And there is Noah down there scoping out my hibiscus. Da da da, Noah. He um he wants to eat the flowers. Um, and then there's a uh, basil plant that my mother gave me that I'm trying to save. So the cup is out there because we do have wasps get in here. Um, they just come in here and then they can't find their way out. So, I don't want to kill them, so I'll trap them with a, a cup and a piece of paper. Now, out here on our downspout, and I don't think you can see it, but there's a robin's nest there, and there are three bobbleheads in there. Daddy was there this morning already. He's been busy feeding them. I wish you could see them because they're so sweet. Oh, maybe you can. You can see one big, one little head there. And out here is our dogwood. And it had beautiful pink and white blooms on it. And a lilac bush there. And the one with all the flowers on it, it's a honeysuckle. Um, in, the, in the dogwood, we have some hummingbird feeders. And my yellow irises are blooming out there. And... You've not got to got to in a good pick. That's my alley. Isn't she beautiful? She's absolutely beautiful. Oh no, a hush. So 
all along the outside of the wall of the sunroom, we have flowers, more yellow irises. The purple irises are gone. This, I don't know what this is, and I don't want to cut it back because if there's flowers on it, if it's a flowering one, will damage the, it won't flower. So, and off in the, back there you can see my, you can see my, uh, weather vane, and you can see my basket of petunias, and behind it is our bird feeder. So we're always looking at the bird feeder, sitting on the swing looking at the bird feeder. There's another lilac bush. Um, we, they weren't loaded with lilacs this year, but they were enough to make me happy. And then our neighbor has a big Bradford pear. Gorgeous flowers on it this year. And this is another lilac bush. And we have flowers all down there in silver lights. And I'm not sure. I think those may have been irises too. I don't recall the flowers. But then is our gas grill. My beautiful weeping willow. I love it. And I'm going to open this door. Noah's hunting for um, voles. He killed a couple of voles. There's our charcoal grill. Our lilies of the valley are done blooming. And the grass is wet. And you can see my pink peonies. Tons of peonies. Oh, yeah. Down there, that white thing, that's my pump pump. That's a cedar tree right in front of you. A cedar tree and a red bud. Here's in my neighbor's yard, my neighbor Larry. This is my beautiful, beautiful sunroom, my backyard. I love it. Oh, in the sunroom, some yellow hibiscus. And got those for Mother's Day. And I want to um, plant them out back there back and back of the bird feeder. So this is my tour of my beautiful sunroom. Thank you so much for taking the tour with me and I hope um, those of you that don't have a sunroom have one someday. It was something I didn't ever think that I would be able to have. So dreams do come true and Happy stitching wherever you stitch. God bless.